Today, I'm going to show you a technique for staining glass. It's waterproof, dishwasher safe, and non-toxic. This tutorial is sponsored by favecrafts.com. You'll need Betraya 160 paint, made by Pabio. I bought these at Michael's Craft Store, and they have a variety of colors and finishes. They cost around $5 each, but a little goes a long way. I chose glossy turquoise. You'll also need Pabio's paint thinner. You don't want to mix it with any other brand of paint thinner because it will alter the chemical composition of the paint. Stir the paint before pouring. Mix a pea-sized dab of paint with about a quarter teaspoon of paint thinner. You can adjust the ratios to get the depth of color you'd like. Paint the outside of the jars with smooth vertical strokes. As a side note, viewers should know that there's a glass coloring technique making the rounds on the internet that features food coloring and Mod Podge. Please be aware that technique is not waterproof and should not be used to hold water or food. However, Pebillo paints are formulated for use on dishes and will even withstand harsh dishwashing detergents. Don't forget to paint the bottom as well. If you make a mistake, dampen a paper towel with water and wipe the affected area. The paint is water soluble until it's baked. Allow the jars to dry for 24 hours. Once the jars have dried for a day, it's time to bake the jars to seal the color. Protect your pan with aluminum foil. Put the jars on a cookie sheet inside a cold oven and set the temperature to 325 degrees. Do not preheat the oven. Bake for 40 minutes. Then turn off the oven and leave the jars inside until the oven has cooled. This will protect the jars from any large variations in temperature that could weaken the glass. You can use your jar as a vase or turn your jar into a festive party cup by using the lid insert as a template for a paper circle. Punch a hole for a straw and you can create adorable place settings to match your party decor. This tutorial is sponsored by favecrafts.com. For more project ideas and tutorials, visit madebymarzipan.com.